Help me! Qu'est-ce qui lui prend They let you come and go as you please. I thought the fortress was closed to all. Aye, but William wishes to have repairs completed as soon as possible. It's been to our advantage. The perfect cover. It's clever. Anyway, I've finished my report and should deliver it. For once, it seems things might go our way. And not by accident. Well, the Bible does say God helps those who help themselves. Nah, it doesn't, actually. That's from one of Aesop's fables. The Bible says quite the opposite, in fact. Many passages of being patient and faithful are waiting for the Lord to decide if he wishes to assist. Well, I say we've waited long enough. You'll hear no argument from me. Very well. I'm off then. Leave now or I'll make you leave. to show for it. Graves and widows and orphaned sons. King Richard promises a better morrow. Unspoiled land and new beginnings. But he's delivered only death. We are too soft with our enemies. With one hand we engage them, but the other tries to embrace. What good could come of this when our king cannot decide what he truly wants? But William knows. If you would only listen. 
Stand up, friends. Do not allow yourselves to be sent to slaughter based on the whims and wishes of an uncertain king. We must rely on men who are stronger in their convictions. Men like William of Montferrat. I'd leave if I were you before I really get it. Bother someone else. I'm pretty sure you should be someone else. that you want. Enough! Enough! What is it you want? Gold? I have a few pieces on me. Take them. Take them and go. It's not gold I seek, but information. I know nothing! You know William. Tell me how to reach him. It's impossible. He meets with the King. And when will the King be gone? Today. But it won't help you. They're sure to argue. And then William will retire to lecture the soldiers. So it always goes. Richard berates William. William berates his men. He won't see you. I already told you. I need to see William. I never said he needs to see me. Then our business is done. Not yet, I'm afraid. There's one last thing I need from you. What is it? Your life. Again, Altair. Always in need of a hand to do your dirty work. This time, Al Muelim did not order anything. It is just for my own pleasure that I ask you to find some Masia flags I've hidden in Richard's district. Since I am a loyal assassin unlike others, I will tell you what people are saying in Akka. It is important information. But this time, try to come back to me faster than the first time. You ever see someone do that before? is changing my opinion of you. Here is what I know about William of Montferrat. He and Richard had a disagreement before the king left for Jaffa. Since then, William stays in his citadel, surrounded by his army. Do you have what it takes to attack him in this protected environment? We'll see, but I am still doubtful.
Altair, what brings you back so soon? I've done as asked and armed myself with knowledge. Speak, and I will judge. William's host is large and many men call him master, but he's not without enemies. He and King Richard do not see eye to eye. It's true, they've never been close. This works to my advantage. Richard's visit has upset him. Once the king has left, William will retreat into his fortress to brood. He'll be distracted. That's when I will strike. You're sure of this? As sure as I can be. And if things change, I'll adapt. Then I give you leave to go. End the life of Montferrat that we may call this city free. I'll return when the deed's been done. Fast forwarding memory to a more recent one. Leave, peasant. Leave. And push them from the countryside. Now they business here. Leave. Three thousand souls, William. 
I was told they would be held as prisoners and used to barter for the release of our men. The Saracens would not have honored their end of the bargain. You know this to be true. I did you a favor. <laughs> oh, yes. A great favor indeed. Now our enemies will be that much stronger in their convictions. Fight that much harder. I know our enemy well. They will not be emboldened, but filled with fear. Tell me, how is it you know the intentions of our enemies so well? You who forsake the field of battle to play at politics? I did what was right, what was just. You swore an oath to uphold the work of God, William. But that is not what I see here. No, I see a man who's trampled it. Your words are most unkind, my liege. I would hope I might have earned your trust by now. You are Arca's regent, William, set to rule in my stead. How much more trust is required? Perhaps you'd like my crown. You missed the point, but this is nothing new. Much as I'd like to waste my day trading words with you, I have a war to fight. We'll have to continue this another time. Do not let me delay you then, your grace. I fear there will be no place for men like him in the new world. Send word that I wish to speak with the troops. We must ensure that everyone is doing their part. Warn them that any negligence will be severely punished. I'm in no mood to be trifled with today. Yes, my lord. The rest of you, follow me. Come no further. You die here! <laughs>
die do here! Look at this you You're not supposed to be here. Whoa. Oh! <laughs> 